always beat up. Will you stop that cacophonous caterwauling? God, you really are hopeless. You can't sing, you can't dance, and you're useless in bed. I don't know what I ever saw in you. Five years of boredom. Why don't you leave or something? You call yourself a master chef? With the muck you've been dishing up lately, a burger flipper could do better. You can say anything you like about me, but don't you insult my cooking. I'm the best chef you've ever had. <laughs> and your last. Here's your breakfast, bitch. Hello. Yes, it's Mr. Edgar from 30 Ellen Road. I'd like to report a disturbance, if I may. I'll tell you something smells good, though. Thank God it's coming to the end of our shift. I'm bleeding, starving. Good afternoon, sir. Detective Sergeant Harrison, Detective Garda Bourne. We heard reports of a disturbance here this morning. I wonder, could we have a look inside, please? Uh. Yes. Uh, just one moment, please. <laughs> have your name, sir. Phelan McCree. Master Chef. Good at your job, sir. Thank you. That smells terrific. Care to join me? Well, finish their shift, why not? Why not? You're very kind, sir. Where's my breakfast? So I gave him his breakfast. You open wide. That's it. Eat up. Eat up. God, I didn't realise I was so hungry. Me neither. My stomach taught me trouble was close. Carve a corpse, carve a corpse, butcher man. Slice me a body as fast as you can. Do you know what I'll tell you? This man's a genius. He should be on one of them television programs. When cooking a 16 ounce strip of loin, make sure the oven is on at 200 centigrade. His partner's written the cookbook. They know. Uh, my wife has one. The Heart of Irish Cooking, it's called. I know. I think every good cook should bring a bit of his own personality to a meal. They know. Ah, uh, you are what you eat. They know. Yeah. They know. Heart, heart, heart. You forgot about his heart, gentlemen. Ah! Very good at heart for forensics. Yes, Lord. 